I am, oh, 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 now you start. I am here. It is, that is Chatham Street. This is Indiana Ave. We're going to remember 1980s Port Richmond, Indiana Ave, Chatham to Richmond Street, probably in two takes. I'm going to start off here. Back in the, the 80s, that was a house. And now it's a tree. But there used to be a house there. Now it's gone. And uh, a lot of people, uh, this was usually a quiet block. I always thought that house with the shingles in the front. There's more houses like that on Gall Street, too. I don't know why they did that, but that's something they do. Uh, in the old brick style, you got the classic brick, and you got like that. That my old house on Gall Street looked like that. And then we're getting to Gall and Indiana. Uh, these headphones, I tell you. The last ones folded up and I could keep them away. But anyway, could go in the end. My buddy Kirk used to live there. And uh, this fence, this wasn't here. That's all new. But this guy always had a lot of plants hanging out. Uh, this was, but first it was Paul's. Before, before it was Paul's grocery store. That's what it was in the 80s. And then it became Aunt T and me. And Aunt T and me was a corner store I worked at for two or three years. Got fired twice. Ladies were my neighbors that owned there. Mariana Teresa. That's the apartment up there. And this is the store. This garage here is where they keep the soda and so where they used to keep the soda. I don't know what they do in there now. It's a store. I was just in there. Got myself an Arctic Splash. Dollar and a quarter now for an Arctic Splash. Uh, this here, I, I worked for Aunt Timmy when this got built. This used to be a window and it would open up and we would serve water ice from six to eight o'clock. We'd be open an extra two hours to serve the fine people of Port Richmond water ice. I don't know why we didn't just let them in the store. That limits their options, but it's something we did. And I remember the day we did it and I was really excited. I used to say Aunt T and me. And now it's the Indiana Mini Mart. Indiana Mini Mart. Okay. And this is Indiana Ave. Um, one time, I had buddies that lived on Chatham Street. And we were in a, having a snowball fight. I don't know if they live here anymore. Or the, the mom might live here. So I'm not going to say their last name. But somebody that lived on this block, a family of girls, were having a snowball fight with me and my buddies. And we paid a trash man $10 to ride on top of the trash truck. And <laughs> we threw snowballs at all these kids. It was awesome. I don't know why the trash man let us do it, but they did. And uh, I don't know. I don't know why we didn't get arrested or anything, but that's something we have. Oh, there's Richmond School. Might have to do a quick one there later. So anyway, when I worked at Aunt Timmy, everybody on this block shopped at that store and i knew everybody and uh i would say this about this block a very tight-knit block that's a always a very clean block um you know you get a little trash on the streets but you're gonna get that anywhere and uh but the houses are always nice and clean okay here we are at belgrade in indiana my aunt and uncle used to live there. They lived there for like a, a month. I don't know why they lived there for such a short time. Now the guy who lived here on this house used to own Paul's, which was Aunt T and me before it was Aunt T and me. And uh, so this is here. Uh, I'm gonna cross. Oh! Crossing guard. I was a crossing guard in this corner. I used to live on Ann Street. I was a crossing guard Oh, in this corner and I got in trouble because I used to step out and stop traffic like I was like I was thinking <laughs> and uh, they would they would uh, There was a, a real crossing guard like a, an adult crossing guard down at Belgrade and Ann and they uh, They would say he's stopping traffic down there and I, I got in trouble But I only if you were a crossing guard for Richmond school, you got to go to the Phillies games uh for free you got to go to one game for free and it was always against like a bum team this is like the society hill section of port richmond 
the porch houses on Indiana Ave with a fence. Now this house here, I, I can't say the name, but uh, it was always rumored that a, a rich person lived here and that there was a pool inside. And I sort of knew the kid that lived there. We weren't really close or anything, but we were friendly. And uh, I heard there was a pool inside. Looking at it, I guess it, it's just two, two row houses put together. And they probably just knocked down the wall. Might be the biggest house in Port Richmond. I don't know. All right. And then this house, this house has always had those curtains for as long as I remember. It's always had these creepy, uh, like, I guess because it's just like a storage room or something. But the, all right, so this is Livingston Street. This used to be the Hornet Church. And that was the, that church's actual name. It wasn't, I don't know what kind of denomination it was. I don't know what kind of church it was, but we used to call it right here at the Haunted Church. <laughs> and, remember the Haunted Church? See, everybody remembers the Haunted Church. So that's the Haunted Church. Now people live there. They probably have to deal with a lot of ghosts because it's a haunted church that used to be. Hey, doing? So that's there. That's the Haunted Church. These are all now houses. Uh, parking is insane around here, but these houses have parking lots, but everybody has two cars. Uh, the twins live there. I don't know if they still live there, so I can't say names. I realized that last video I made, I was giving out names. I was like, oh, I don't know if they live there or not. Uh, we are at Almond in Indiana. This is Almond in Indiana. Uh, that's Powers Park. That's going to probably be a video unto itself. Uh, I'm going to just cross the street because there's kids outside the library and I don't want to look at creep. I guess the library will probably be a video un un unto itself. What the hell am I trying? Unto itself? I don't know. So these are more of the, again, Society Hill section of Port Richmond. Fenced porch, porch houses on uh, Indiana Ave. I don't think I really knew anybody that lived in these houses. There's the library. That was owned. Hold on, pause. Alright, there's the library. I'm not going to go in. Well, look, it was owned by Andrew Carnegie. Isn't that? Huh. Right. So that's the library. Still open. Alright. I'm going to go down these steps. Alright. And we got... Right, society Hill. That's another nice house right there. Um, this is Mercer Street. Now, I don't know when this happened to me, but you see how that car is driving down that street? I can't drive down these small streets. Especially, look, they got cars on the side and that. I can't drive down these small streets no more. Ever since I got these glasses, they say they're supposed to help your eyes. They don't help anything. I'm blind. Now, if I take these stupid things off, I see worse. I don't know who they're supposed to help. All right, so this is uh, that that spawn that was sponsored. My, that grant was sponsored by Warby Parker. Uh, this is Richmond Catering Hall. It might have had another name. I don't remember what it was in the '80s. I don't think it was anything. It became a catering hall in the '90s. I remember everybody in Port Richmond had a job here. Not me. I didn't work here. I worked in Aunt Timmy making two dollars an hour. But you know what? I respect Aunt Timmy. They told me I was getting paid. I know if you watch the Perry's one, Aunt, I love Aunt Timmy. I even I mean, I'm gonna even stop by to say hi to Marianne right now. All right, so we're at Thompson in Indiana. So that's gonna be a. This is where we're gonna take a little stop. There's the. Fort Richmond PBA. Uh, I don't know what that means. There should be some signage. All right, there's Stokely. We're gonna, we're gonna, I guess we'll do a little bit in there. All right, that's it. That's Richmond, Indiana to Thompson Street. That Thompson Street, this is an, this is the street down there. Oh, a lot of traffic. Uh-oh. That street caved in. All right, there we are. I will sail with you later, Toodles. Toodles.